We've done the gays, we've done the straights, we gotta do Gen Z. We're back, baby, reacting to another episode of The Button. <laughs> YouTube's favorite reality series. YouTubers' favorite reality series to react to. The reaction videos get more views than the videos themselves. Is that normal? I'm new to the reaction channel game. Hi everybody! <laughs> For those of you who are new here, my name's Elena Joy. I make videos on this channel mostly about the queer community, sex, dating, relationships, but sometimes I react to cut videos now, I guess. I'm pretty sure three videos makes it a series. Wait, wait, I did some of the lineup videos too, didn't I? I also guessed some stranger sexualities. I've done more than three, this is definitely a series. So if that's your thing, subscribe. Was the button there? The button! That's what we're watching today. Okay. <laughs> Too much coffee, Elena. Calm down. Cut put out an episode of The Button where it's Gen Z singles rejecting each other. So of course I need to watch that because the women rejecting each other was like very gentle and kind and sweet. The straights rejecting each other was ruthless. What's Gen Z gonna be like? Part of me wants to say that Gen Z is gonna be even kinder and more understanding than the lesbians, but part of me wants to say they're gonna be even more ruthless than the straights. They're Gen Z. They don't have time. They don't have time for your nonsense. Well, let's find out. Are you attracted to each other? Mm, not quite yet. Oh, I just met you like 30 seconds. Oh, you don't ago. goth looks? Yeah. Are they 10? Why do they both look like they're 10? Oh, <laughs> because they're Gen Z. Oh my God. Oh my God. How old is the oldest Gen Z. What year does Gen Z start? Gen Z age range. 11 to 26. So not 10. So 10 would be one of the few years they are not. 26. So really, we're gonna say anyone born in the 2000s. Oh my god, someone could have been born in the year 2000 and they're 23 years old right now. That's unacceptable. That's unacceptable news I was just given. <laughs> Okay, so they're between 11 and 26, but considering they're on a dating show, I'm assuming they're between 18 and 26? 21 and 26? How old do you have to be in the USA to date online publicly while being recorded? 18, I would assume. Tyler oh. does improv theater. Oh, you do? Yeah. <laughs> That's so cool. Yeah. Yeah. Can you do some improv? Right, right now? Yeah, yeah let's, let's do, do it together. You can't just ask him to do improv sitting at a table on the spot. That's not how improv works. Like, improv is a team experience. I'm so afraid this is gonna be cringy to the point of unwatchable. Okay, okay. okay. Later. we're gonna go and to the park today. Yes, and we're probably gonna swing on the swings, right? <laughs> yes, <laughs> and... Literally saying yes, and are they? Oh no! Oh no! He just Tyler just got an improv 101. Tyler has taken one improv class in his life, and he's like, I do improv theater. Yes, and I do improv theater. Go for it. I'm so sorry. You are so nice, and I will come to your improv. Yeah, do it. Okay. You should totally do it. I totally will. <laughs> this feels. This feels strange to me, and I can't exactly put my finger on why. I think it's because they're Gen Z, and I am not. I am a millennial. And so this feels very teenager. Like, I feel like they're in high school. But they're both very sweet. We're off to a sweet start. So the sweet side of Gen Z is winning. We haven't hit Ruthless yet. My name's Katie. What's Katie. your name? Khalif. Khalif? Good to meet you. Is it Katie and Khalif? Oh, Khalif's got style. Uh, no, I feel like, listen, uh, it's part of the outfit. Like the uh, And now glasses Khalif is talking shirt, about his style. Like, Stylish. A little bit. Yeah, it all goes together. I'm model inside for a little bit. Ooh. Then, Khalif is more what I was expecting. When I saw Gen Z, in the title, this is what I was expecting. Very stylish, models on the side. Oh, and this is why I wore this outfit. Because I wanted to know, now that we have the Gen Zers here with us, like, this is cool, right? Some would call this a fit? Let me know in the comments. Because I feel fitted. I feel like I'm in a fit. Khalif, what do you think? I'd love to get your input. You might have to teach me because I'm not that good at fashion. I mean, like, I can feel it. Have you ever dated a model before? I've never... I feel like Katie, yes, is gonna be too simple in terms of her style for Khalif. Khalif is like matching the shade of his sunglasses to his overshirt, and Katie's like red t-shirt and jeans. Done. 
This doesn't feel like a good match to me. In my professional cut opinion, this doesn't feel like a good match to me. And I am the authority. I've reacted to multiple of their videos. Do you only go for models? Um, not particularly. I'm, I'm open. I'm open. Okay. Yeah. How old are you? Fun fact oh, about it, it, it has to be red. <gasps> oh. Listen, I, I he just, just tried to that. push the button. He just tried to push the button before it was even red. She said she's not a model. And he's like, yeah, that's fine with me. Someone get her out of here. Someone get her out of here. I do only date models, but I don't want to say that. I don't only go for models. Why'd you press it right after that? Because I was thinking, I was thinking like, okay, I can feel it. You're not I'm a model. It. No, 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 no. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> it was right. nice to meet you. It was fantastic. <laughs> Did he explain why? Oh, why'd you reject me? Yeah, why'd you reject her? Why'd you reject her, Khalif? If it was not a dating show, yeah. I would want to talk to you for like yeah, a while. That's how I felt with the other guys. Yeah, 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 we have like 10 minutes yeah. though. I got you, fantastic. I got you. That's good. Oh, my name's Sierra. Sierra's Sierra, got Sierra's got more of a look going on. The tone of Sierra's hair matches the tone of Sierra's shirt. It's like the tone of Khalif's sunglasses match the tone of Khalif's shirt. There's potential here. We've got potential, everybody. Are you each other's type? Um, I have a lot of types. My type is people that look like my celebrity crushes. Who's your celebrity crush? Like Kristen Stewart. Say Kristen Stewart. Oh my God, say a woman. Who's your celebrity crush? Oh my, oh my God, say a woman. I can feel it. I can feel it coming. She's gonna say woman. Or she's gonna say like The Weeknd. Like Alex Wolf. Does he look like Alex Wolf? Who's Alex No, Wolf? but that's yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. I can't think of it right now. <gasps> Why, Khalif? Look at her. She's cute and sweet. What are you thinking? Buttoning her. Damn it, Khalif. You ruined this for all of us. Who's next? Who's next for Khalif? Izzy. Izzy, Khalif. Nice to meet you. Hi, Izzy. Nice to meet you. I am in tech. What do you do? I sell cars for a living oh, in tech. Okay. Oh, Isabel she sells cars. She has four cats. She has four, four cats. One of them isn't mine, it's okay. my roommate's, but yes, I was given a cat by my... I'm sorry. No, I, I... She did not hesitate. This is the Gen Z that I signed up for. This is the Gen Z I signed up for. She doesn't like a guy in tech. She doesn't like a guy in tech wearing his sunglasses indoors. Too cool for school. She doesn't like that and I stand with her. I need to stop doing this on the desk. Like what, what am I accomplishing? I'm putting my finger down. For what? For what? Hi. Hello. What's your name? My name's Izzy. What's your name? Izzy? Brendan. Brendan. Nice to meet you. Yeah, you too. Do you have a tattoo? Yeah. Are you Italian? I am Italian. Brendan's Italian and Brendan's bi. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just trying so hard to make this gay. I just, I just want it to be gay. I've reacted to the lesbian one and nothing's been the same since. Fact about Brendan, his hands are always clammy and sweaty. I don't know, texture's a thing for me. Oh, but for But sure. I don't really mind my feet get clammy. <laughs> <gasps> I knew it was coming. <laughs> ah, I'm sorry. It was nice to meet you, though. Hi. I'm just not very physically attracted. I'm sorry. That's okay. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> they are ruthless. They are ruthless. They're like, you're an uggo, frankly. Can I be honest? You look like a troll. <laughs> oh, my tailbone needs to crack. Ow. Who are we bringing out next for Brendan? A dude? Okay, no, actually, I'm just realizing as I'm talking, I shouldn't be speculating on people's sexualities, actually. I probably shouldn't be doing that. One, I hope it's obvious that I'm not making fun of the fact that Brendan might be bi or the fact that anybody would be bi. It's it's not meant like that. And also, whoever might not want to be seen as bi or queer or whatever, and I shouldn't be, I shouldn't be putting that on. Other people, that's on me. I'm gonna stop doing that. I just want it to be gay. <laughs> I want it to be gay, and so I'm gonna, I'm gonna guess that everybody's gay. I'm realizing as I keep making the joke that, that maybe it's actually not a funny one. Let me self-correct mid video. Fred and Anna, nice to meet you. I like your overall. Anna. Thank you. My Tattoos. Fun fact about Anna, she always puts her friends before you. Well, I mean, as a good friend should. Okay. That's not a red flag for you? <laughs> no, if anything, that's like a good thing. Okay. Like, yeah. Something happening here? Maybe. Mm -hmm. Perhaps we have matching nose rings. We do, yeah. that's true. I could see you two together. All of Gen Z has nose rings. That's what we're learning from this episode. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
She pushed it. Actually, there's someone else out there that I think you would really vibe with. Okay, yeah. I like the sound of that. Yeah. Cool. It was nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Wait, what? She buttoned because there's somebody else she thinks he would vibe with. So like she met someone in the green room and she's like, you're a bit of Brandon. That's probably the nicest way you could button somebody is be like, oh no, this isn't about me and you. I've just got your best interests at heart. <laughs> Oh my god, hi! I literally was just eating a granola bar. <laughs> there it is. There it is. There's the bi representation I've been waiting for. If I would just zip it and have a little patience, the folks who are openly bi, openly queer, they can come to me. Shut your mouth and the queers will come, Elena. <laughs> I hope they win. Can't wait. Why should someone date you? I don't know. Uh, e <laughs> <laughs> That's a really hard question. What are your hobbies? Like, what is? Um, if you describe yourself in like three. I'm an like, English major in school, so I'm always. Like, oh, you're still in school. Writing something. Yeah. What year? They both have dyed hair. They both have colored hair. They both have their noses pierced. They both have cool style. They're both Gen Z. They're both into. Ladies. You graduated or? I did graduate. Oh, yeah. what was your major? <laughs> art. Oh, okay. I mean, obviously. <laughs> we would like the Could art been, I'm, so, I'm so sorry. It's okay, it's okay. What? 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 <laughs> Why? This is what I was talking about. Gen Z doesn't have time. They don't have time to spend with someone that they're not into. This might be the fastest we're ripping through them yet. Bound to happen. All right, I'll, I'll leave, leave, I'll leave, I'll leave. No, thank you so much. <laughs> thank you so much. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'm Jasper. Jasper, nice to meet you. Oh, that's a cool name. What's Jasper? your name? Anna. Ooh, tattoos. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I don't have any, but I really want one. Really? Yep, okay. can't decide. What would you get? This is really random. Okay. I have to say, one, I think Anna has something in her teeth. Is that just me? Is that Anna's gums? I think she has something in her teeth. Two, her eyebrows are everything that I wish my eyebrows were. My eyebrow hairs are very long. You might not be able to tell. Let's hope you can't. They're very long. And so if I try and do that, like, you know, brushed up, laminated kind of look, <laughs> These, these bad boys become half my face. <laughs> and I know I could try to trim them, but the shaping, there's just so much pressure involved. So I stick to this. But Anna, I want you to know I'm envious. I've got eyebrow envy. A butterfly eating a cheeseburger. I love it, let's go after this. Heck yeah. yeah. Heck yeah. yeah, yeah but crazy. she didn't button him for that. He said a butterfly eating a cheeseburger. Is that judgy? Am I being judgy right now? Is this whole video just me being too judgy? She seemed to like it. Butterfly eating a cheeseburger. Butterflies don't even eat human food. Why, why does that bother me? Why does that tattoo idea bother me? Elena, doesn't affect you. Doesn't affect you. Not your body, not your friend, not a person in your life, not anywhere near you. Doesn't affect you. Just watch the video. Yes. Wait, so... Yeah, what happened to your teeth? Oh, I knocked them out. It was a pool incident. I was just like, I was bending down. What? <laughs> Did she just take out her front two teeth and put them back in and the thing's still stuck in them? Or is that not something stuck in her teeth and that's just like part of her fake teeth? We hit the cue ball too hard, popped me right in my face, knocked me clean out, so. When you said pool, I thought you meant like swimming pool. I can't swim. Actually. Oh, okay. I just can't figure out if that's something in her teeth or if it's a gap or what's happening. But now I must know. I can do the worm if you want. I can do the worm too. Wait, actually? Yeah, I think so. I haven't. Listen, get in here. I have a friend out there. Her name is Jade, she's awesome. We can both do the worm. Okay. We're looking for other wormers. Yeah. And we're gonna start a troop. We're gonna collectively Wait, are we gonna do it do where like, worm. like I'm grabbing like your feet? No, and then, no one's oh, grabbing oh, anything. Oh, okay. Oh, 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 that would be cool though. Yeah. Okay, Anna is everything. Anna is everything. Like I just need to hear more of Anna talking. I need to know more about her life. I need to hear every story that she has to share. If it was like, like a human centipede yeah, type yeah, worm. Like, yeah, that's what I was thinking. We would- Is this a sex thing? No, God, don't be gross. What in the world? Are you into each other? Do you see each other going on a second date? I am. Yeah, I can, I can see that. We can practice our worm. Why are you into her? I think that we're just vibing, you know? Yeah. Since the second that I walked in, it was, you know, it was the hello. Hello. It was the eye contact. Mm. That's a big part of it too. That is true. Yeah. You two would be a really cute couple. <laughs> So yes. interesting. Oh this is so interesting. I didn't expect it to go like this. 
I didn't expect it to go in a not gay way. I, his voice threw me off. How can I watch these videos and not be judgy? How can I react to them and comment on them without being judgy? That's the whole point, isn't it? Isn't that the whole point? I just, his voice threw me off and I assume that my perspective is shared by everybody, obviously, so I, I'm glad they're vibing. I hope it works out and they live happily ever after. Oh, and then the butterfly tattoo thing. He's just not for me, but maybe he's for Anna and that's okay. <laughs> I'm gonna light up red one last time. If you do not press me, that means you two agree to go on a second date. Oh, wait, wait, wait. And you I, win the button. I need to ask one question. Mm -hmm. One question. Are you into feet? It, no, why? Okay, Are okay. you? No, I'm not. I, okay. I, I, I just, I don't like feet. But you I, I don't make, like feet? Yeah, not, not a big fan of them. I think he's just saying he won't rub your feet. Okay. There we go. All right, I'm gonna light up one more time. Is that a deal breaker for Anna? Damn, you guys won't rub the feet. Nice. Thank you. <gasps> Wanna go on a second date? Yes. Hell yeah. Burger worm. Burger worm. Burger worm. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Congratulations, you won the bike. Thank you. Oh, wait, we won? You get to go on a Did second we win, date? Win? You found right. love. I need to know who the other one for Brandon was. When Anna was like, oh, there's somebody else back there that I think you'll like. What gave her that impression? Who is this mystery person? What about this mystery person screamed for Brandon? Did they meet and did they fall in love? I have follow-up questions. They really do need to do follow-up videos on these button people. Let's look at the comments, shall we? They need to have one for seniors, absolutely. I would react to the shit out of that. I would react to the shit out of that. I would watch that and film myself watching it while reacting. Anna was so cool and laid back, I'd wanna be her friend. Is there somewhere we can find her? The consensus seems to be that this was a very polite and Gen Z episode. I concur. I concur. All right, do you like these cut reaction videos. Now that I've I've done enough of them to officially have it be a series, let me know in the comments down below. And as always, an extra thank you to my VIP patrons, my vitally important producers. You all make my world go round. Follow me over on Instagram if you don't already, because that's where the magic happens and the climbing. Do you like climbing content? I do so much climbing. Also like, hello, the fit. Is this fit on Instagram? Not now, yet, but like maybe it will be at some point and then you don't wanna miss that. Just go follow me on Instagram, okay? It's fun over there. And that is it for this week's video. Thank you so much for watching. I love you very much and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. I'm a button pro. I know everything there is to know about the button. Ah, there's just so many sex jokes to be made and I don't, I don't wanna be the one to do that. You can make them. You can make them for yourself at home. It's a choose your own adventure, a choose your own <laughs> G-spot joke adventure.